I started diving when I arrived to MIT. I know that water dulls down the human senses, but just as I jump in the water, just everything changes. I have a hearing loss, and though I've struggled a lot in my life to become par with the society, I also admit that it's sometimes liberating. I can shut off my hearing aid. I go into a very meditative world. Underwater, your other senses are also dull. And because of this sensory dull experience, it relieves my stress when I dive in the water. And I wanted to give that experience to people. Connecting disability and diving, I came up with this idea of Amphibian, which is a virtual reality scuba diving simulation that can help people experience the wonders of scuba diving on land. We simulate the, uh, the swimming movement by having the person rest on a spring tartar that promotes weightlessness, and the person attached to the elastic band that promotes gradual motion as the person swims in the underwater environment. And those elastic bands are attached to the sliders that move on top of the mechanical assembly, and that gives you the drag force that is offered by the underwater. For people who are non-divers, or people who are like me, who are like terrified of water, it's like a whole new experience. You can get a sense of what is it that real diving might feel like. So it incorporates a whole bunch of sensations that current VR projects that are related to scuba diving may not incorporate. So we thought we wanted to build something a little bit more believable. You can feel what it's like through your hands. You can grab objects. In any virtual reality system, I think the biggest component has been and still currently is the visual component, right? So we use an Oculus Rift DK2, which the person puts on. The next aspect is audio. And since sound is sort of muted underwater, that's how the sound in our system also plays. Because you are going down in water, you know, you see the base of the ocean floor. We have a Peltier module that attaches to the glove in lower temperature as the person is going down. And then we have a buoyancy system where when they breathe, the cushion inflates and their body goes a little bit up and down. Drove is all about diving, and right, he comes back from his diving and talks about this was so awesome, he shares his videos. And I'm like, I wish I could do that. It's like, okay, well maybe I can do it. <laughs>